After being a weenie for a week, we're playing The Last Door, a game developed by The Game Kitchen and released in 2013. It's a points and click horror adventure, and this is chapter one of many chapters in the series. What's through the door? I guess we'll find out. I'm Demo Blah, and welcome to Flash Friday. Okay, I'm feeling pretty antsy, but let's head in. I'm in headphones. I, I'm wearing headphones and I'm sitting in the dark, so I'm ready. After all the things I've seen. After all the things you've seen, what? Uh, I think I grabbed some rope. That is a painting. Um, is that a chair? After all the things I've done. Um, I'm setting up the chair for something. I'm getting a feeling of what it's being set up for. Considering the rope. My life is on a course that I can't escape from. Okay, uh, we're helping the guy out, I guess. It's too late for me now. Is it, man? Um... I just hope you could forgive me someday. Okay! Yours sincerely, Anthony Beechworth. Oh! What a start. Welcome to the last door. So many people involved in the project. Sponsors! Made in Spain! There was a pilot game that originally came out in 2012. 2012, yes, before this game was released. October 1891. Videte ne qui sciat. I don't know Latin, so hopefully there's not much more. That's the only thing my dear old friend Anthony Beechworth wrote in his letter. It had been many years since I last heard that sentence. It used to be the motto of the science and philosophy group that we were secretly ran back when we were in that secluded boarding school in Scotland. They left it all behind, like simple childhood memories. But it was unusual. That letter could only mean something awful must have happened. Something that must remain absolutely secret. I had to find out what was going on. Without delay, I took the first morning train to Sussex, to the address on the letter. And there it was, the old home of Anthony's family, the Beechworth Mansion. Ah, uh, fancy English countryside. Chapter 1, The Letter. Okay, I got me a lens to look through things. And I, of course, am... Pointing and clicking. So let's let's go around back and see what is around the outside of the mansion. Um, 
we we got some things. Immediate action. Uh, I guess some crows are eating up a something. Maybe want to check it out. There's a pile of rubbish in the back. Good old door. Seems to be locked. Uh, do we, do we want to deal with the crows? You know, and they're oh okay, they're a little vicious. Okay, we're not gonna get close. Uh, have a good old day, you crows. Keep 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 nomming on those om noms. This is weird. Everything is silent. Like there's no one living here. I'm worried about Anthony. I have to find him. Okay. So we're making ourselves at home, taking off our jacket and stuff. Yes, that is your coat. A portrait of Anthony, who looks older than I expected. Okay. A grandfather clock. It's the only sound around here. Well, it does seem to be the sound of some wind. But I'll try not to mind it. We got a gramophone. Looks rusty. Drinks cabinet with glasses, some crystal bottles, and a matchbox. Okay. Fireplace? Looks like it hasn't been cleaned in a long time. Meese. Oh, it's a deer. Large window is wide open. Letting the cold dusk air in. Okay. That's a black looking door. Uh, okay, inwards we go. Okay, the hallway, not well lit. Just, just what I like. My, my favorite. Let's check out this door. Is it locked? Oh, it's very open and super creaky. Okay, we'll keep checking out the hallway. More paintings of landscapes. That one's crooked. We should probably fix it. There we go. Dude, you didn't fix it. You turned it... Oh. Oh. He's not very good at fixing paintings, but... Uh, we have revealed something. An old rosary with a solid wood crucifix. I'm taking it. Hopefully it'll help me. Um, but, man. My my dude is not very uh, good with his hands. A small plant brings some life to this place. It's not getting much light. So, it's not going to be bringing much life <laughs> quite soon, I feel like. Um, that looks like it's missing a cross. I do have a crucifix. So, should I just put it there? Let me check out the rest of the room first. Some toiletries. Very good. There's nothing of interest in these drawers. Okay. Is that a dog bowl? An empty bowl, like the ones used to feed a pet. Okay, it is. Not, the, not sure what the thing on the wall is. There is a hole in the wall. Yes, it is very dark. Note. Read to me. March 5th, 1891. Master made us get rid of our religious objects. What is going on with him? Luckily, I found a place to hide my rosary. Can't pray every night without it. May 18th, 1891. Master has been complaining about Alfie. What would a simple cat do to him? He ordered us to keep him out of the house at all times. Still, I can't let that poor thing starve. He's such a clever cat. Every time I open the window, he knows food is waiting for him. Anyway, I'm worried about the master. He's growing more and more unlike himself every day. September 15th, 1891. Mr. Beechworth is spending whole days locked inside of his office. He wants us to leave him food at the door, but he barely eats anything. I'm really worried. Okay, this lady's having it rough. Beechworth is losing it a little bit. Um, okay, I guess I won't put the rosary back. 
for the crucifix. Wait, a crucifix is significantly different than a rosary. A rosary is way smaller. Um, so maybe I'll find a crucifix somewhere else. It's padlocked. Okay. Now that we've explored the hallway and the one room in the hallway, let's go back through the terrifying door on the left. All the doors in this game are terrifying already. I'm really okay with the doors being less terrifying, you know? A plate with some days old leftovers. Days old is like relatively recent. Like, my dude here. Oh. He did seem to be driving by car, or was it a carriage? If it was a carriage, I'm sure he didn't get here that quickly. Kitchen stoves and a cleaning cloth. Plates and pans. Okay, uh, nothing else, it seems. Moving on. Cooking ingredients. It's definitely a kitchen. Uh, I guess it was a one-sided door, because I'm... Yeah, okay, we're back out in the back. What is that? Oh, I just walked. Don't mind me. I'm seeing things. And here we are back again in the foyer. That is dark. I'm not a big fan. I don't like the change of tone. That door is not opening, and I'm getting the heck out, because nah uh nah uh That, that was a hallway that I don't want to deal with at all. Um, but what do I do? Because I think at this point we're just at a loop then. Correct. Maybe uh, there's something out back. Can I go this way? The fields surrounding the house stretch majestically as far as the eye can see. I didn't know Anthony was the owner of such properties. Well, maybe the fields aren't Anthony's. Okay, what am I missing? Yes, the portrait. Is that a note? A note on the table, oh. Dear Mr. Beechworth, due to the recent events, the situation has become unbearable for us, and much to our regret, we have no other choice but to leave. We will remain forever grateful for all these years at your service. God bless you, Mr. and Mrs. Brewer. So the rosary is probably uh, from those people. Yes. Okay. Oh man. I'm getting really antsy already because uh, things are scary. Or they feel scary. I am scared. I, I get scared very easily and it seems like, that has not changed. <laughs> okay, so we have a rosary. We've gone to the room. Am I, am I missing something? Come on, check out the hole. No. I, I feel like I need to find, like, a flashlight. Ah, there's a lamp. I didn't realize, it looked like a decorative function, but can I light it? Um, maybe when I bring it to the darkness that was that other area, um, it'll, it'll start, it'll turn itself on. Oh boy, I don't like the... I don't like the air here. Okay. I do need to light the lamp somehow. 
Okay, let's get, let's get lit, <laughs> as they say. Maybe the uh, kitchen has something? This is the fireplace. Hasn't been cleaned. Oh, what's this on the thing? Oh, matches. Perfect. I had a tough time seeing that, but um, it's a good thing the hand changes the tone. Okay, I still don't like the atmosphere of this room. Thank you very much. Is that something I can light? Is this a lamp? Can I? Can, no. Okay. There is a missing painting. There's a few missing paintings. Yes, some of the paintings are missing. Okay, we keep going. That's boarded off. Okay. Very good. And we keep we keep going. Oh, oh, Nelly. Oh, Nelly. Can I light any of the? these things okay let's open up the door get me out of here uh the, the other door is that locked that one is locked okay that one uses a key the other one was a padlock very different okay music is less scary covered in dust a silver key Okay, great. A gentleman with a serious and inquisitive look. But it's not Beechworth? Fireplace that hasn't been used in a long time. Okay. Why do I have to walk over to this? Okay. Let's open up the balcony thingy. Oh, I need a tool. Family portraits. Can I light the uh, fireplace? No. What about with the matches? Oh, okay. We're too cool to light the fireplace. Okay. So we have a key. Wait, we have a key. Uh, let's check on the first door here. Wait, did I even grab the key? I did not. I just stared at the key and was like, ah, I don't need it. Not today. Maybe another day. Keys? To unlock doors that I possibly have seen? Key doesn't fit. Okay. Let's get out of here. I don't like this hallway. It makes me uncomfortable. The music is nicer now, but the hallway is still very dark. And the boarded up door is a no thank you for me. <laughs> okay, what about... This one is locked, right? It won't open. Okay, well, let's go for a padlock. Padlock one was in this hallway. Um... Yes. Walk, walk, my friend. Use your legs. Keep using them legs. Okay. Key better work or else I'm dumb. Yes, use the key. There we go. No. No, 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 no. No! <laughs> okay. Okay, we can do it. It was just a basement. Places have basements. Sometimes they're all drippy, but that doesn't mean it's not okay to stand in the basements. Okay, a slate record titled The Carnival of Ven Venice. Let's put it in the gramophone. Why not? Okay, checking out the thingies. They got wine. They got drippies. They got wood. It's, we're not, we're not going to grab the wood. That's a crowbar. Let's grab that. Because I know some boards that could take a beating. What else is that? Boiler. You want to load it up? No. Okay. Okay. Let's not load up the boiler. Let's keep walking. What is that? Fresh cement. Are we going to have a dude boarded up behind the wall? 
because uh, there's a story written about that, and it is not a pleasant read. Poe done did it already. Get creative, story. <laughs> we we don't need we don't need the same story twice. Okay. Um. Well, I have a crowbar and a record. Let's do the record first, cause God knows I may not be pleasant, or the opening of the boarded area may not be a pleasant thing, so. Wow, great, let's turn it on. I don't like this, I, I really don't like this. Can you turn it off? Uh, I don't like this. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh. It broke. Okay, let... Did you go back? No! 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 You were outside. Not inside. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. What the fudge? What the... What the fudge? What the fudge? Are they still there? They are! They are still there! What the fudge? How did they do that? Are they done with the thing in the back? Oh! They ate a crow. They're cannibal crows. Wait, I'm going to... What am I going to do with this crow? I... I picked up a crow. What? <laughs> I, 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 I just, I'm, it's screaming. What am I doing with the crow? Why do I have, why do I, what is, oh no. It's dead. It is now dead. Why, why did I pick up the dying crow? Oh, it's not dead. What the fudge? What is going on? Okay, the crows are gone. What's that all about? Okay. Why Why am I carrying a crow? Where did all the crows go? Where did they come from? <sighs> I am stressed, y'all. Uh, okay, I get it. You're dying, my, my dude. Oh, God. Okay, let's open up the boarded area. Why did I pick it up? <laughs> Who just pockets a dying animal? I understand things are being weird, but like pocketing a dying animal is on you, you know? Okay, let's go in. Uh, it says, leave me alone? There's a body. There's a body. Oh. Oh no. What's the note say? The crow is just screaming. The crow is just screaming. <laughs> uh, I'm writing what will surely be my final thoughts, my last lines, my last breath. I don't know what kind of dark power has turned my husband into what he is now. A stranger with a look bereft of all sanity, compassion, and human warmth. I don't know what shadow that slowly darkened our... I don't know the shadow that slowly darkened our lives. I don't know this foreign host that will now that now dwells in our souls. I don't know where it's from, but I'm sure it is not from this world. I will meet my brothers and sisters soon. I will be free from this abyss of madness and fear soon. I will stop trembling. Oh. No, crow. Just, just. Oh, can I put it out of its misery? Oh. Uh, dear Margaret, it's been days since Anthony left his office. I can hear him whisper angrily, frightfully, and it gets worse at night. Our servants left a few days ago. Without their help and care, I'm lost. I can barely walk out of bed. Not even the doctor would come here after his argument with Anthony. He has developed his this horrible ability to break anyone's will. I don't know what to do. I don't have any strength left. I wish I could send you this letter. Your dear friend, who's Margaret? A hairpin. Okay. Hairpin, an old wheelchair. 
This lady is not having a good time. But I don't know how she could have scrawled in blood when I can't go on all is lost. You know, like if she can barely write letters, she definitely ain't scrawling in blood. I can't stand their stares. They watch me. They judge me. They despise me. I know they think I'm not worthy of this family. Who are they but dust and bones? A memory. Leave me. I don't need you. Leave me alone. Okay. 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 Uh. Oh boy. Okay. I guess we have to go through the room. Oh my gosh, what do I do with the crow? I just... Okay. This looks kind of like that starting scene. But... Not quite. Because this is in the attic. Yes. These paintings are unsettling. One of Anthony's relatives. Why do I have to walk over to this one? Oh. The paint looks fresher around the lynx's head. Okay. I don't have anything that I think is good for dealing with that. There's a crow behind the window. Can I move the painting? No. Okay, we're just... We're gonna come back. We'll, we'll come back. Looks like there's nothing else. Uh, I don't know what to do with this rosary still. Yeah, looks like it doesn't apply. Okay, we're just gonna keep kicking. I, what's this crow doing? Um, there was a locked door over here. I'm feeling like the panic that is in this music. Uh... Maybe I can use the hairpin to lockpick the door, because everyone can lockpick when... No, okay, I can't force it. Wait, I needed to... Uh... What did I need to open this? Okay, he said a small tool. A hairpin. There you go. Okay, let's go out into the balcony. I went into the side room. Okay, very good. It's the Lynx! Okay. That's good. I I just want to get rid of the crow. I'll be honest. I'm like rushing to get rid of the crow. A few press clippings spins the wall. The Illustrated London News, 1887. Judge kills himself under strange circumstances. Earl found dead floating in the Thames. Famous actor found bled to death in his hotel room. Uh, those are some clippings. Map of the reach with markings on it. Sounds like a conspiracy. Um, okay. That's fine. Common hammer. I'll take it. Maybe I can... Just... Get the crow out of... <laughs> How would you like to kill it? Man, just like, put it out of its misery. Okay, chemical experiments. Wow. A thinner. I can use the paint thinner on the portrait. Very good. Okay, I don't know what that is. Strange books. That's fine. Let's open up the door. Great. What is this? Torn out pages. They won't bother me anymore. I'm done with their sensuous gazes, their whispers. It's all ready. There's only one thing left to do. What is, what is left to do? And I guess I can't get that. There's a golden keyhole. Okay, a golden keyhole means a golden key. Uh, back into the creepy area I go, I guess. Yes. Here. Paint thinner. I know what that was. Okay. Yes. Paint thinner. Oh, you could ruin it. Uh, I have to mix it with something? 
water it down. I don't remember seeing any, uh, like, water. Oh man, why does he keep screaming like that? Oh. Oh man. What do I... What am I gonna mix thinner with? Okay, well, let's go back. I... I do have a hammer. And you know what hammers are used for. I don't know what hammers are used for. I'm trying to say things because I'm so uncomfortable. It is not the only sound around here anymore, dude. You have a dying crow in your pocket that is screaming. Okay. Paint thinner and blood? No, okay. At least he's not that crazy. Is there something back here, maybe? No. Okay, let's go back. What is this? Old cloth? Oh, maybe I can combine that with the thinner. Yeah, there we go. Be a little nice about, uh, nice to the painting when I wipe it off. Okay, um, going in. Here, no more crows. Thank God, there's no more crows. I am not drawing those curtains back. God knows what's behind those curtains, you know. After the whole crow thing and the fact that they all freaking disappeared, ain't risking that business. No siree. Oh man, I. This crows. Why'd I pick it up? Why would I do such a thing? Okay. Let's get rid of that lynx. Remove the lynx. Connect the lynx? The thinner has worked. The fresh paint around the lynx's head is gone. The original painting. The lynx is different. Its mouth is open as if it was growling. Okay. What am I, su what am I supposed to do with that? Do I look at the lynx? Oh man. I should have gone through the door, but that's fine. Mouth is shut. Time to open it. Open it. Shove a crow in it. You don't want to shove a crow in the links? How do I open how do I open it? Stick a rosary in it. I lost the crowbar. How do I open the lynx's mouth? Maybe I'm missing something here in the room. Few notes. That goddamn cat. He meows every night and it's for me, I know it. He's mocking me. He knows my secret. He knows. I won't let him ruin everything. I don't have any choice. I have to put an end to his miserable life. Or Better yet, I'll make a blind, you Gabby Gabby Lynx. You won't confess, you wouldn't. Okay, obviously there's something there's something in the Lynx. How do I how do I deal with uh... Oh my gosh. Wait, strangle it. That was what you're gonna do with the rose Oh my gosh. Okay. Um. Wait. Gold. Okay. I don't know. I don't. I'm. I'm just trying things out at this point. I'm desperate. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um. Should I dip something in that product? What if I lit the product on fire and caused a hazard? Okay, no. You're right, that is pretty unreasonable. Okay. Um, let's see if I miss something.
I'm not sure. What do I use a hammer for? Hammer. Hammer, hammer, hammer. Oh. What, do I do something to get let the crow in? Can't I just move the painting? Okay. We we keep going. We keep going. I still don't get why I can't just light these little thingies. Okay. It still won't open. That's fine. That's it's fine. I'm I'm okay with this. Wait, did the music stop? Okay. Okay. Oh, oh boy, I'm stressed, y'all. I am very like it just keeps screaming. Let's light the fireplace. The other one didn't want to be lit, but maybe this one does. Nope. Okay. You sure you want to leave it alone? It's pretty odd. Maybe you could put a crow on it and have it hear its calls as it dies on the gramophone. No, okay. I still don't know why I have the rosary. There is still the hole. Wait, can I deal with the window? Well, what is giving up? Some sort of cord. I guess I could use the rosary. Why do I need to keep the window open? I don't know why I just did that. Uh, let me leave. Um... Uh, I don't like the basement still. Basement still. Basement still. I do have a hammer though, and I could crack some cement. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna smash the wall, smash the wall, smash the wall. Here's a hammer. Please don't have a body behind that. Okay. Uh, turns out that's not the answer. Oh, okay. I don't think I was ready for that. I'm like, I haven't dealt with little crow boy in my pocket yet, so, um... Yeah, wasn't, wasn't ready. Is there something in here? Because of the... No? I'm like, the cat was outside the window, right? But like, uh... The lynx is totally dead, so... Oh wait. I just had a thought. What if I put the crow in the bowl and then and then the cat comes? Oh, this is Oh, it is. Oh. No, you don't feed. You don't feed. Oh. I I don't think you Do you I don't have a pet. Do you Oh. Okay. Every time I open the window, you know his food is waiting. Okay. So, I've opened the window, food is waiting. Kitty cat gonna come, I guess. That is not good food, my man. Like, you could do one up than a dying crow. Okay.
That's a meow. It's on my right now. It's a super echoey kitty. Hello, kitty. Oh, where did the crow go? Maybe we have to follow the trail of blood. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. What is happening? Okay. Yes, there is a hole to the wall. Oh, it's further right. Okay. Where did the kitty go? Oh, yes, kitty. Meow. Ow. Okay. It's mighty echoey. You're probably behind the wall, aren't you? Yeah, you are. Yeah, you are, you little kitty. I'm gonna break down the wall now. Okay. His eyes are missing. Ah! Okay. Well, I would also rip out your eyes too if I was missing some. Okay, there's an open chest with a dark cloak, a mask, and a knife. Not a body. Only the knife can be useful. Excuse me, dude. Have you ever cosplayed before? A mask and a cloak are pretty good for that. Okay, let's let's get going. We have a knife. Um, fed the kitty. We're finally rid of the crow, but I'm not sure I feel good about how we left the crow. You know. Also, how the heck did the kitty know that the door window is open? If it can't really see. I don't know. Just gonna try not to think about it too much. Okay. Stabby stabby. Uh, what's stabbable? A stuffed lynx is pretty stabbable. My hand's like really tense from clenching along with my butt. <laughs> Everything's clenching. Okay. Maybe if I cut into this. Nope. Okay. We're, we're not cutting into any paintings today. Guess not. How about into the links? Here we go. What secrets do you hold, you little stuffed fur ball? Managed to get the link's mouth open. The tongue has been removed. There's a golden key instead. Take the key. Use the key. We have a hatch. We're gonna find him. Anthony's up here. There he is. Oh god, no. Anthony, no. Yep. Uh, sorry, I, uh, we kind of did it. Because we literally clicked through the steps earlier. A portrait of Anna, Anthony's wife. It looks like those were happier times. Well, yeah, considering how things have ended up. There's a sealed letter in his pocket. Dear J. Devitz, if you're reading these lines, then I am nothing but a dead body hanging before you. I write to you in my last shreds of lucidity. You can't possibly know how pleased I am knowing that you've arrived on time. You are one of my oldest friends, and when I sent you the letter asking you to come here, I didn't doubt for one moment that you would. Had you failed me this night, everything would be lost. I have found myself involved in a series of horrible incidents. For reasons beyond my comprehension and sanity, I have become a total stranger to myself and to my closest relatives, capable of the most indescribable and atrocious acts. Can't give you any more details now. I must ask you to go immediately back to the boarding school where we made that pact, where we all said that sentence that would always protect us and swore with our honor before the other members. This letter must not reach anyone else, so I'd like you to destroy it immediately. The lives of the rest of the group and yours are in great danger. Do not delay. They're already waiting for you. Seeing is believing, Devitt. Don't forget it. Always your loyal friend. Anthony Beechworth. Oh! No! 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 No, thank you. No! There's so many! Hot dang. 
Hot dang. Hot dang. Oh god, I'm so... Okay, we made it. Whew. I am flipping out. Um, yes. So that was chapter one of The Last Door. I need a break. But you can continue on. There's four chapters, I think, in total. And they've even released some more past the Flash series onto Steam. So as always... Links will be in the description down below. Definitely check out their games. They have a few other Flash games that have not been as successful as the series. But, yes, they have made many a game, Game Kitchen. Um, and this game was terrifying, so I'm sure you'd enjoy the rest of the series if you found this as enjoyable as I kind of did. Well, what is behind the last door? I guess that's for you to find out. As always, I hope life treats you swell. Toodles.